Welcome dear friend. In this video, we're going to show you how to fix system UI is not responding error in Android. The steps that we are showing not only fixes this issue, but also cleans your Android phone and makes it run faster. Without further ado, let's get started. Solution 1. Clear cache. Please open settings. Interface and navigations may slightly vary based on your device model but the approach should work for all devices. Once you are in settings, please look for apps or app management and open the same. Select app list. See if you can locate system UI. If in case you couldn't find it, please go ahead and select the dots menu and tap on show system. Now we should be able to open system UI. Please force stop. Choose storage usage. Over here please tap on clear cache. Let's go back, and this time please look for Google Play services. Choose storage usage. Over here please tap on clear cache. In case clearing cache did not fix your issue, later you can come back to this place and try clear data as well. We're done. Please come out and restart your device. Solution 2. Clear junk files. Please open Google Files app. Ensure that you are in clean tab. Please clean junk files. In addition, please check for available space over here. Probably you're getting system errors because there is no much space left on your device. Please come down and select delete large files. Tap on this menu and select largest first. Now go ahead and select all unwanted files and delete them. Solution 3. Uninstall and used apps. Please open Google Play Store. Select your profile icon and choose Manage Apps. Go to Manage. Now please select all unwanted apps. Please tap on this delete icon. This will uninstall the selected apps. Solution 4. Update device and apps. Please go to settings. Scroll down and see if you have software update or system update. Some of you may need to select system and advance to get this update option. My device is up to date. But for your case if updates are available, please go ahead and apply. We should also update the apps. While you are in Play Store, please select the profile icon and choose Manage Apps. Over here please select Update All. This will now download and install all app level updates. Solution 5. Factory Data Reset. This step is very powerful in fixing these types of issues, but please remember this will delete all data in your device. Later you will be able to restore your contacts, photos and WhatsApp messages, provided you have enabled appropriate sync and backup. Please go to Settings. Select Additional Settings. Scroll down and choose Backup and Reset. Please select Erase All Data or Factory Reset. Select Erase All Data once again. This is the final warning, if you're all set, please go ahead and select Erase Data. Post Factory Reset. 
please follow on-screen instructions to complete device setup and data restore. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, please add your comments below, I'll respond to you. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done already. Thank you so much for watching.